New tonight, residents in Lakeside pushing back against a monster truck show planned at an equestrian park. People there say that is not what the property is used for, and the event will bring a lot more problems with it. Our Kasha Gogorczyk is joining us live from Lakeside uh, with more on that controversy. Kasha. Yeah, good evening, Kathleen. The Diane Jacob Equestrian Park is surrounded by a residential area with many ranches that house horses and other livestock. So the local equestrian community now has a number of safety concerns. It's just not a good location for it. Great event for sure. Wrong location. Lakeside horse owners are speaking up after hearing a monster truck show would be rolling through the local Diane Jacob Equestrian Park. We all love monster trucks. But you've got the issue of the sound of the direct horses that are right beside it. The park is surrounded by boarding facilities and horse owners say the noise could cause serious harm to the horses. If something spooks them, there's no telling what they're capable of doing. If they get extremely fearful, they could try to run through a fence. They could injure themselves. People could get injured trying to calm their horses. The national touring company Monster Truck Wars is currently advertising two shows at the equestrian park to take place next month. The company contracted by the county to run the park, Equine Event Services, sent Fox 5 a statement that says they've mandated the Monster Truck event to make modifications to their muffler systems to bring noise down to what's permitted by the county and are continuing to investigate the community's concerns. Still, some residents are wary. This is a residential area area, a two lane road. Traffic is another issue raised and because the park is an equestrian property, there's questions over how the event would damage the arena that horses depend on being maintained. You could destroy your horse's legs on destroyed footings and, and footings that aren't properly maintained. So to hear that monster trucks are going to be coming in there and tearing up that footing that they spent a lot of time and money getting perfected uh, was shocking. So local residents tell me they are continuing to share their concerns with county leaders. But meantime, Equine Event Services tells Fox 5 this event is permitted by the county and as of today is happening as planned on March 23rd. Reporting live in Lakeside tonight, Kasha Grigorczyk, Fox 5 News. Kasha, thank you.